Hello and welcome to DCS World and the Razbam French Mirage 2000. I'm in a flight of four French Mirages. We're being scrambled to intercept a group of MiG-29s that are inbound. Our mission is to intercept them and if necessary engage and destroy them. Let's get our clearance. Okay, runway's all clear and we have a takeoff clearance. Let's go. Nose wheel locked. Full power. Okay, we're going to climb above this precipitation layer and we're going to swing south for intercept. set the autopilot into a five degree climb. Keep the speed pulled back just a little bit until the flight can rally up. Let's get the aircraft ready. Turning on the electronic countermeasure systems. Good one. Passing waypoint five at thousand. Countermeasure set to auto, and I'm going to go ahead and turn on the radar now. Let's turn out these external lights. Picking up the spike, MiG-29. 
So they're emitting with their radar. They're about 20 degrees off our nose, so I'm going to swing left. And course correct. Put them right on our nose. Let's get the weapons ready. Bring on the gun switch and the master arm switch. And I'm going to select the centerline tank for Field. jettison. And for those MIGs, push the scan out to 80 nautical miles. I'm not picking them up yet. There's the flight. Good, they're catching up. Okay, I'm going to add more power. In fact, go to full power because we need to climb. I want to get up to at least 30,000. Climbing at 15 degrees now. Oh, I just picked him up. 47 nautical miles out. Okay, I closed the jettison switch and I put the aircraft into air air flight mode. So we have maximum maneuverability as we engage these MiGs. Coming up on 31,000 feet. I'm going to take the autopilot off, level out. Two contrails on the right, and I can't see this guy on the left. And then I see an exhaust plume in the middle. They're painting me. I'm going to jam them. We're closing at 1100 knots. 25 nautical miles out. They launched. Breaking defensive. Okay, I've got to defeat this missile, and then I'm going to turn hot again and engage those bandits. Got one locked. Fox one. Missile track looks real good. Oh, my wingman beat me to it. I locked up another one. Fox one. He got splashed too. Switching to IR guided. I've got tone, but I'm out of range. Fox 
Box two. I'm going to engage this guy too. Box two. Oh, I splashed him. Looks like that guy... Oh, I got him. I got him. I thought he evaded my missile, but I got him. Looks like he's still flying. He hasn't ejected yet. He might be going in, looking that way. Yeah, he's going in. That's all of them. That's RTB. Flight, join them. Turn in north. I'm gonna get a vector back to the airbase. Kunskaya, in field. One, one. Request navigation assistance. Heading 326, okay. Descend down to the top of this cloud layer and then we'll look for a vector into the airbase for a final approach. Two for 12 miles. Okay. I'm going to descend below this cloud layer now. There's the airbase.
Kamskaya. In field. One, one. Request landing. Well, I hope you all enjoyed the flight and enjoyed the rain, the beautiful world DCS has created for us, and the lovely French Mirage 2000 that Rosbound has made for us. Pretty amazing that uh, you know we could have been on the ground 15 minutes ago. We flew over 80 nautical miles, splashed four MIGs, and we're already back, all in the space of 15 minutes. I'm going to pull into parking here. Shut her down. I'll set the parking brake and I will turn the engine to the stop position. Cut the electrical power and the fuel pumps. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.